uh, what you are interested in but while like you know talking about the features i would also like you to uh, just see what all feature i mean it is a platform and what all things do we offer in this basically you know is my voice audible sir yes yes okay, okay. first of all basically it uh, it is a app based uh, mobile attendance system in which the basic thing is it is based on face recognition and here the selfie attendance is what basically is uh, something which everyone who are actually carrying this particular app can give their attendance with the geo tagging you know and mm -hmm. uh, apart from the geo tagging we can also have geo fencing feature uh which means uh, if you want uh, that people should only be punching from their uh, relevant location uh, basically we can uh, make the fencing and only when they are inside that particular location basically mm -hmm. then only they will be able to give the attendance you know so this is suitable for even office people also in case uh, you are having small offices where lesser number of people are there and you don't want to deploy a attendance machine you can have this particular machine also okay perfect uh then uh, we have got a feature called team attendance basically with product productivity analytics uh here what we actually offer actually is like offer small, let's say you are having a small team and you want the team lead to take the attendance of the entire team you know it may be a contracted team it may be a subcontracted team and things like this basically you know and you want that you know maybe you do not want to give them the uh, logins but you would like the uh, team manager or the team lead to take the attendance you know so this is something basically which is also there as part of the feature mm -hmm. uh then there's a work from home uh, uh like you know uh, process basically which is there uh, wherein we have a full approval workflow over here where in this today scenario where people are working from home you would like uh, the work from home approval to be given from your side and only once the work from home approval is being given then only they should be allowed to log in into the system you know so there's a approval i mean the employee can directly provide the uh, uh, the application and this application would go to his reporting manager his reporting manager is going to uh, uh, once he is going to approve the system then only he can do the work from home basically you know and once the work from home has been given then he can do the attendance from his house also okay perfect uh then as extension of the work from home we have got job allocation you know so which means basically uh, like job a uh, person can give himself a job like you know if i am working from home and i am doing multiple jobs at the same time i mean during the day and you would like that you know your team should actually earmark the time sheet kind of a management where he does the job allocation to himself and say that from this time he is done this particular job and till this time he has done this job and want uh, to give the some uh, some kind of a uh, uh text basically where he explains what he is doing you know so let's say if he is doing a project for customer a he works from 10 am 10 am to 11 am you know so he can check in at 10 am and give the job to himself for customer a and then check out once he finishes that particular job give himself another job at 11 10 again work on that particular job at yeah, the what yeah. time and this is a job sheet kind of a thing uh, which like you know time sheet kind of a thing which he can map to himself and uh, this is something basically which goes to his manager as a reporting as a report also so the manager can see that during the whole day during the work from home what all jobs he has worked on yeah i go this is quite this is this is quite interesting yeah yeah we will show you this actually happening sir yeah. this is something basically wherein like you know we will be showing you uh, the workflow as well yeah some some portion we are doing right now but uh, it is not uh, fully comprehensive but we will see i would like to see your uh, solution right sir uh, then we have got this desktop monitoring uh, wherein like you know if the guys are doing work from home or if they are not doing work from home uh, what we are having is basically this desktop monitoring of the employee desktop basically as part of the productivity you know 
so the part of productivity what we speak is like you know uh, we have a timer which is currently being set as 10 minutes in 10 minutes if there is a uh, movement on the screen basically it will be captured basically you know and it will be mm-hmm. the screen will be captured and if there is a job being allocated to him during that time it will be associated with that job you know so let's say i am doing a job for a customer a between 10 am to 11 am so between 10 am to 11 am whatever screen captures have been done that will be tagged to the particular job you know and uh, then the guy can see what all he has done and he can see the desktop associate with the job he was doing you know otherwise if we do the desktop and like you know put it in a kind of you know uh, library or a, a, a folder and if we just want to see time based uh, what all screens you have captured it may not make too much sense so that is why uh, there is a job scheduling which is there and that job scheduling is something to which these screen captures can be tagged to and every 10 minutes in case there is no movement on the screen then uh, we do not capture so that is being treated as a idle time as a productivity uh, 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 bar- uh, parameter basically you know so while we are working how much time has he worked uh, during the day based on the number of screen captures we have done we actually calculate the productivity time also out of 8 hours let's say you have captured 10 into 6 60 captures basically of the screen that means he has worked for 6 hours so 2 hours may be taken as a idle time or something basically which may be another analytics which can help you in trying to see the productivity of an employee you know yeah yeah perfect uh, tell me one thing the solution is a uh, cloud it is fully cloud driven so fully cloud fully cloud driven okay so that means if user is not connected with vpn right the his uh, attendance or his uh, desktop monitoring stuff will get recorded right right sir it is something basically like you know vpn is not a necessity at all uh, the only thing he should be connected to the uh, internet that is the only thing yeah shall i go ahead sir yeah yeah please then we have got something called task tracker uh, where you can have group chats and scheduling this is something like you know which is to replace a, a kind of you know whatsapp communication so it's a sort of you know a chat a window through which you can do a chatting uh, you can create tasks under that task basically you can create multiple people under that particular task it is just like a project and the project team can talk to each other regarding that particular project and that is being captured as a group chats basically you know so mm, this good, is good. Which, uh, which is uh, like you know maybe in case you are running a project or something and there are multiple people in the project you can define the project into multiple uh, line items of a time sheet basically so one project will have let's say 10 uh, milestones these 10 milestones basically is something which can be defined against a particular project and different people may work on different uh, milestones and they can do the time sheet based on that uh, milestone as well basically you know so you can do use it for your job posting as well perfect uh then there's a employee tracking with google map integration which is there so this is typically like you know in case you have got uh, you have got these uh, field guys uh who may be sales or service guys basically you want to track them uh, on the google map this is very basic i mean i'm not explaining too much on this so this is a employee tracking thing is also there and then finally in case you have biometric or face recognition machine and you want to get integrated on the same platform so while you are doing a, a work from home some people may be doing work from home some people must be working from office and if you want everything to come together on a single platform so that you can see the attendance of the entire population of your organization you will be able to see this basically on a single platform as well basically you know so here we integrate the machines which is hardware and mobile app which is basically there in the hand of a person basically you know yeah and, and maybe a sales team who is there on the field so we take care of the attendance 
which are like you know working from office which are working from home which are working from field basically you know so this Good. is a kind of solution which we are talking about 